welcome so we are going to part 17 but we are also cover remaining programs means uh, already i take five series and uh, 6 to 16 also we covered today and uh, these are the important programs that is the reason we are discussing early okay and uh, i request three things to my viewers that the first one is most of the people are registering student in but they are unable to write the examination due to <coughs> not watched mock test video completely second point is some of them are wrote the examination but they are not answered all the questions and not spend much time on answering all the questions i request you have to spend 90 minutes of time and completely answered all the questions after that we will get the um, our panel get the complete view and view key to know what is the right answer what is the answer you at you choose it and what is the solution for that mathematical solution we also indicated clearly so you have to utilize the opportunity what we provided and third point is on 3rd Jan 2019 at 7 p.m. I am conducting live stream to give tips for TCS mod hiring for BSc and BCA. I will take 30 minutes for explaining the tips and what not to do, what to do. These things are explained very clearly. After that, I will clarify all the doubts regarding TCS mod hiring for BSc and BCA. Coming to the program, our goal is to convert binary to octa. Before directly we cannot convert binary to octa. So that what we are doing is we are converting <coughs> first binary to decimal and we need to print using percentage elbow to print the equivalent decimal to octa number. So firstly we need to do take the number and that number is divided with 10 so we will get the remainder of 0 that remainder plus rem, sorry 0 plus remainder into b initially we initialize it to 1 and multiplying with 1 to get 0 and now the b is equal to b into 2 so 1 into 2 is equal to 2 next again the value of n is decreased to divided with 10 obviously 1 0 will be reduced so in the next case again we module with 10 so we will get 0 0 remainder and 0 plus 0 into 2 is equal to again 0 so the value of b is equal to 2 into 2 that is equal to 4 now again the value of n 1100101 by 10 is equal to 11001 and again we need to module with that number we will get we will get 1 now 0 plus 1 into 4 is equal to 4 that is equal to 4 b is equal to 4 into 2 that is equal to 8 and now again we dividing keep on dividing we will get 100 now, this number equivalent decimal number is equal to 100 so that number is printed with percentage elbow so look at it in the program so right this is the most important point why because we are also giving some support on command and arguments if the question written in the form of command and arguments it helps you to clear it and here void main int org c character org v this is the character array and this is the number of arguments we need to pass the first argument is the program name remaining are the required arguments so that here 
arg1 is a string type and that is converted to an integer by using a to i after that we assign to c and r is equal to c mod 10 means we are moduling with 10 the binary number is modulated with 10 to convert to get the remainder the remainder is metric wave with b and sum to s and c is equal to c by 10 and b is equal to b by 2 b into 2 so completely we get the decimal number the decimal number is converted into the decimal number equivalent value will be printed using lo percentage lo format specifier is percentage yellow thank you